Today is a big day for the Library and Archives. We have been anticipating this rare books collection from David Winter for a little over two years now, and the books are here. And it's here that the journey of the remarkable book collection of David Wenner finds its new permanent home at the Niels Bohr Library and Archives at the American Institute of Physics. This tremendously expands and deepens our rare item collection in particular at the library. Its value is not just in the individual items that are in the collection, but the way they've been collected and the way they've been catalogued and the stories that they tell in and around the discoveries. Handling and transporting the more than 3,800 book collection was no small task. Professional art movers were called in to pack and move the books over a thousand miles. We take a look at each book individually. You know, so it really depends on the material. We're looking at the condition of them. Certain books have, you know, an age or a condition to them that we really need to pack them a certain way. For now, the large book collection leaves an empty space in Winner's home. It's going to leave a gap in my library for sure, that <laughs> I'm going to have to fill somehow. But for AIP, the collection offers scientists, historians, and really anyone interested, an opportunity to see truly amazing books that may never have been available to the public before now. Now with this arrival, we are strong and provide value for our historians of physics going all the way back to the 1500s. We've been talking and thinking and planning for the arrival of these books for the last two years, and now we switch gears into providing access to these books. The next step will be a more than two-year-long labor-intensive process of describing and cataloging each individual book for an online catalog where researchers from all over the world can search the catalog, um, discover books that are relevant to their research, and then come here to use the books. And we also, I think, are starting to think about how technology can really help us make the collection available to as broad and as global an audience as we can manage. Now that Wenner's shelves are empty, so starts the process of filling rows of bookshelves at AIP, their new forever home. I'm very, very happy to have it go somewhere where it will be appreciated. Help preserve this historic collection of rare books and manuscripts in the history of physics by donating to the Physics Heritage and Promise campaign and help make an historic collected volume of works accessible to everyone.